Welcome to Michael's Prime Meats. This afternoon we're going to fabricate a fresh chicken. We're going to skin it and cut it into parts and fillet the breast. So let's start. Very easy to do. You can do this at home. Take your chicken, turn it on its breast. Right there at the joint, take the tip of your knife, take the wing right off. We can remove the wing tips. Now to take off the skin, it's very easy, it's very much like an overcoat. Just come down the back, take your thumb, run it against the bird, peel the skin right off. And we take the legs, force them out of the socket, to expose the joint, and come right around. Take the side of your knife, come across the leg and you'll feel the joint and you can go right through. Now we can perform liposuction, take off the extra fat because we know you don't want fat. You want to stay as healthy as possible and eat as little fat as possible. Now we'll take off the back. Take out the chicken fat. Remove the tail. Take off the extra fat off the back. Now we'll turn to the breast. Remove the extra skin and fat. It's amazing how much fat there is on a chicken. You wouldn't think it, but there's plenty. Through the center of the chicken breast, we have a piece of white cartilage here. And all you have to do is nick that cartilage and take the breast and expose the keel bone. They call it a keel bone because it looks like the keel of a boat. That's where they got the design from. And we'll cut through that soft cartilage. And we'll begin to remove the rest of the bone on the inside of the breast to make fillets. You take your knife, you go against the rib cage, and bring it right up. And over here is part of the wishbone. Take that little wishbone out and go right down. Now there's still a little bit of cartilage left from the keel bone. So you want to be sure you cut that out because it can be a little chewy. Okay, over here now we have a half of a chicken breast. And what you have here is a full half of a chicken breast. If I open it here, we expose this little piece here that we call the chicken tender. Now there's a little cartilage, a little piece of nerve in there that you really should remove. Okay, now we'll do the other side. We're going to take the other part of the wishbone out. Again, we're going to come with the tip of our knife against the rib cage. Okay. Again, we're going to remove that center cartilage and this thin membrane here. It would not be very palatable. Okay, now if you'd like, you could bake these as they are, or if you'd like them thinner, I would recommend getting a couple pieces of wax paper and sandwich it with rest in between. And pound it down. This would be conducive for a chicken cutlet, 
a chicken cordon bleu. You could roll it and stuff it. If you'd like, you could cut it in half, make two small ones, make chicken scallopini. Now we'll do the other side. Of course, you can always make stir fry out of it as well. Basically, that's about it, and that's how we fabricated chicken at Michael's Prime Meats. Thanks very much. We hope you enjoyed that demonstration.